How does the author structure the text? An author arranges sentences differently depending on her purpose. In a chronological text, events go in order from first to last. In a problem solution text, the text describes a problem and how to solve it. In a description text, the text goes into detail about one idea or concept. In a compare and contrast text, the text describes how two things are similar or different. And in a cause and effect text, it shows how one thing makes something else happen. Let's practice identifying the structure of a text by looking for signal words. We'll read this paragraph together. A manicure is when you paint your nails. Manicures are fun ways to treat yourself and show off your favorite colors and style. This might be a description text because it's talking about manicures in detail, or it might be something else. Let's keep reading. The first step to a manicure is to trim your nails. Next, wash your hands. This gets rid of dead skin or dust that might get in the way of nail polish. Now, start painting. Choose a color and paint it onto your nails. Wait for the polish to dry and then paint over your nails one more time. I realize that the text is teaching me how to give myself a manicure. It gives me a list of steps in order from first to last. Because of this, I know that it's a chronological text.